Another concept that's fun to talk about with a preschooler or an early elementary school child is called symmetry. Symmetry is actually a concept of higher math, but it's easy to introduce at this age. So let's talk about symmetry. If I were to take my circle and turn it, see how I'm turning it around and around? It still looks like a circle no matter where I have it. It looks the same. But if I were to turn the rectangle, that changes a bit. Now it's long and now it's tall. So if I turn it just part way, one turn, it gets to be kind of wide. And if I turn it this corner to the bottom, then it makes it tall. If this corner comes over here, I'm going to push it again, it makes it wide again. And if this particular corner scoots up to the top, now it's long. So sometimes the, the rectangle can look like this, And sometimes the rectangle can look tall. It can even look slanted. But the circle always looks like a circle, no matter how it's rotated. Let's see if we can find out what happens to the oval. If we spin the oval. Hmm, that's kind of like the rectangle. It got wide and then it goes tall and it can look slanted too. The heart. The heart. Oh, that really it looks different, doesn't it? Not like the circle. Remember the circle always looked like the circle, but this looks like a heart mm, kind of upside down now. This is called orientation. And when we're spinning it, it's a rotation. Let's see what happens to our square. If we turn it, one turn, it looks like square. Here's my, the corner that I'm moving, where my finger is. So if I move that corner up to the top, oh, it still looks like a square. How about if I move it again? Yep, still looks like a square. So when we rotated, our square and our circle looked the same, no matter how, how we put it. The circle, though, even looks like the circle when it's turning. The square doesn't. Now it looks a little crooked, and it doesn't look like a square again until we make the complete turn when this corner has to move up here before it looks like a square again. It, it is a square, but it, it doesn't look like the square that we started with until it gets back to that position. Orientation of the shape is important, especially when we start making patterns.